So, so tell me a little so bit about what's going on there. So Ignite, Ignite kicked off, mm -hmm. and one of the things that they kicked off with was some of the 2D and 3D Microsoft Team stuff, and, and one of its mesh, um, which brings kind of the oh, no. 3D virtual reality avatar. -y I don't know what, avatar like. I don't know what's presence. creepier that they're floating torsos in a room or that they're running Microsoft Edge. We were we were joking around. Well, don't forget, Edge is just Chrome now. I know. Um, I know. I listen. But, listen. I'm using I, I'm using Edge for a chat room right now, actually. So the the we 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 were joking around about it today that it requires an upgraded license and it's an additional five dollars for legs. Um, <laughs> five dollars for legs. That's the upside. We were joking around, but it's it's not true. But because it is kind of creepy that they do float around. Mm -hmm. um, if you look at that one picture, yeah, they're they're definitely like torso up. And then I said, can I get a discount if I give my torso back and just use the the a floating head license? A floating um, head license. <laughs> but I, I did think it was cool how they had kind of the side by side two avatars talking, um, where mm -hmm. you could walk up, like it's it's almost kind of that VR ish feeling um it will do live transcription so they're borrowing some of their existing tech the other cool thing if you look at the picture towards the bottom it looks like it's in a uh right there mm -hmm. um you are actually going to be able to take and design your own 3d physical space well virtual physical spaces um to base them off of of what whatever you want right so if you wanted to build 